Did you know electric cooperatives give cash back to their members over time? I'm Kurt Collier and I've been the Vice President of Finance and Accounting at TCC for a couple of years now. We've filled a lot of questions about capital credits or cash back for members in our department and I'd like to explain how they work. The profits of a cooperative are called margins as with any other company. Because TCEC is owned by its members, we allocate our margins to the membership in the form of patronage capital. The allocation amounts are based on a formula that considers the amount of revenue paid to the cooperative by the member. Patronage capital reduces the amount the cooperative has to borrow because TCEC retains and uses patronage capital for operating capital. It is used until the financial condition of the cooperative, determined by TCEC's Board of Trustees, permits the co-op to issue a refund in the form of capital credits. Another way to explain it is that electric cooperatives operate at cost. At year end, after paying all operating expenses, the cooperative allocates any remaining operating revenues as patronage capital to the co-op's members. In the following years, patronage capital is used to help finance improve and expand the electrical system. This reduces cost, increases reliability, and keeps your rates affordable. When the cooperative's board of trustees determines it's time to retire patronage capital, then you receive a capital credit check in the mail. Returning capital credits to members illustrates the universal cooperative principle called members' economic participation. If you belong to a different type of electric utility, you would not receive money back in this way. Capital credits are just one of the many benefits of co-op membership. Giving money back to our members in the local community instead of outside investors or shareholders, that's the cooperative difference.